busy neighborhood plagued with dropped cell phone calls may finally be getting help. But the solution has been proposed before and some residents still aren't happy with it. TV 10 video guys Hazel Sanchez has more on the controversy from Mawa. When it comes to cell phone communication, people living in this neighborhood in northeast Mawa say it's tough. Most people have to go outside to make uh, calls. A lot of times I drop calls right as I make that turn there. Mawa Mayor William Laforette says the one mile radius surrounding the fire company number three station house off Masonicus Road is a dead zone for cell service. It's a major concern for police patrolling the neighborhood who rely on their mobile laptops and anyone trying to use their cell phones to call for help. The mayor says an emergency in the area during tomorrow's storm could be disastrous. Yeah, I'm a mayor of the town. It has a responsibility to provide a, a uh, safe work environment for officers and the community. I can't say without the component of cell service that we are absolutely doing everything we can do. After past failed attempts, the town again is proposing to improve cell service in the dead zone by building a 150 foot cell tower here on the firehouse property. Bill Almonte lives right next to it. He says he's totally against the plan. Definitely in this area, surrounded by a bunch of homes, a lot of little kids in this area. It just doesn't make any sense. We uh, enjoy our backyard. We certainly don't want to be looking at something, a massive tower. Some residents say the need for a tower can't be denied. They're suggesting it be built in wooded areas further away from residential neighborhoods. I mean, it has to go up no matter where they decide to put it. Mayor Laforette was supposed to meet with service providers tomorrow to discuss other possible tower locations or alternative solutions to to the dead zone, but the meeting had to be rescheduled because of the snowstorm. In Mawa, New Jersey, Hazel Sanchez, TV 1055. Now the Mawa School District is also looking at some of their property for potential space to build a tower. Lonnie Quinn back